and then um, <coughs> playing some multiplayer. I prestige once, so I'm about to prestige again. I yeah, no, I stick to those games first. Really, and I still got my Jet Miller character. Put him on here and put my face on him, and then. Uh, made a tire and then, no, I don't play online. Freaking server sucks anymore. I tried to get a one on one match with Tyler and then it just wouldn't let us connect or nothing. So I was like, Yeah, <laughs> I ain't going. The only way I'll, I want to beat the whole entire game before I do that, before I go online. I'm still doing the career. <laughs> I've had this game since it came out. Thanks for coming in. Thanks for coming in. I appreciate it. Hit that follow button. Follow me. I got 21 followers so far. Let's get this going for the Intercontinental title. I finished that 365 days. I was World Heavyweight Champion. Got the tag team done. Now I'm starting to work on the Intercontinental and US title after this. Thanks for coming in. Chat on the chat board. I'll talk to you. You want to talk about wrestling? We'll do that. Oh yeah. Let's get this Fear Nation started. Okay. Sorry. It's <laughs> the whole thing I have on uh, Twitch. Twitter. YouTube, I done redone my YouTube page, it's exactly how my gamer tag is. Redone it all Just start on this. I could have done it a long time ago, but I just worked too much. Worked myself in the grave. <laughs> yeah. Any more here. Yeah. Gotta keep myself busy. Gotta keep myself busy. My mind wanders. <laughs> I don't let it do that. I still feel the after effects of losing my old man and then my mom. And then my big show running out. Yeah, oh God. Hey, you want big show? Oh, distraction. Big show trying to distract me. Yeah, get off me. <laughs> Looking motivated now. You got your career done. The lock up. Look at these two jockeying for position. Uh, trust me, Michael. There's nothing routine about this. The sooner you can get an advantage over your opponent, the better. Well, on the topic of Dolph Ziggler here, tell us your thoughts. Definitely looking good so far. Hasn't taken I'm too on, much uh, to this 2021. Point. Working for control. Yeah, you could. You could. You got a. You go get a story like when you become champion, you can shake Triple H's hand or punch him in the face and they attack you. Dolph Ziggler appears, WWE fans pay attention. They know they're going to see one of the most talented superstars to ever lace up a pair of boots who will keep them on the edge of their seats from bell to bell. Yeah, you can. I mean, it just depends on who you have a rivalry with, but most of the rivalry, the only actually thing they just interrupt your matches and take from behind or you do the same to build a rivalry uh the only one actually storyline they have on here is uh it doesn't even look like a sweat has been broken the one with the authority and stuff look out love it pretty much totally in his back pocket right now about it. Whoever starts a rivalry with you. Mine's usually uh, Sheamus or one just interrupting my match with Big Show. Uh, I have rivalry with Brock Lesnar, Triple H, or. It just depends on who you're having a rivalry with, but the only actually storyline 
that pops in would be uh, authority. Like when you become world heavyweight champion, they want you to shake their hand or to potential injury there. This guy's a oh, that one, yeah. You know, to have a legitimate chance against Dolph Ziggler, an opponent has to now I gotta get the Intercontinental to become a like a five time Intercontinental champion. Down and keep him out of the air. An opposing <clears> pretty much. Could have a chance. Oh, and stay the heck away from the zigzag. I was too. Then you got to keep your partner for like uh, on the Hall of Fame. It's like uh, it's got to be, be three-time tag team champion, have the same the partner or something like that. The ladies become the central point of this attack. It's only a matter of time before assistance to walk will be needed. Uh, anybody got a crutch? Yeah, I know. Me too. <laughs> I was like, he's the first one to help me. Help me. I was like, <laughs> I was like, well. <laughs> They're just beating up on Dolph Ziggler right now. Is so accomplished, and it's so important for an opponent of his to go in there with a plan. Trying to get this. And that plan should revolve around. Yeah, I was off this whole weekend. Miller, there it is. Yeah, I think it's Miller time. Miller time. Oh yeah, it's going up top. He's still down after that. There we go. Miller, there it is. Yeah, I think it's Miller time. Nobody's watching me. <laughs> Goodbye, Dolph Ziggler. <laughs> yeah, I've just been trying to clean everything on the Hall of Fame list, except for I can't do that one because you have to lose every match for like three years when you reach NXT. I didn't know that till I reached the main roster, and I was like, I ain't starting a new one. Like, takes too much of work. So that's probably the only one I won't complete on the Hall of Fame list. Didn't Jet Miller will probably retire. Like I still have to work on the showcase though. <laughs> I haven't even I haven't even started that. <laughs> I haven't even done none of those. I just work on my career first since they amped it up. And Please they welcome my guest Please tonight. Please welcome my first name in it. Let's talk <laughs> about Bo Dallas. Bo Dallas. What about Bo Dallas? It seems Dallas? like you two are getting along. I ain't getting along with Bo Dallas. Tag team? Like hell no. I ain't no tag team partners no more. I'm focused on my singles well, career. Rumors, but that, that is, is just not, not the case, case right now. now. I'm focused on my singles matchups. I haven't even. Else. <laughs> Maybe some other time though. For <coughs> I haven't even done a WWE championship. I haven't even done the WWE universe yet. <laughs> Let's talk about the Big Show. You two nope. have been clashing a lot lately. The only thing I've been working on my career, but not much since I've been working. Big Show rivalry. Hmm. Sure, why not? He's trying to start a war that he can't finish. That's fine. I'm up for the challenge. I just hope he's ready for the fight of his life. That's right. This is not just a rivalry for me. He is standing between me and what I want. What I want. He'll soon regret that. He'll soon regret that. <coughs> nah, I'm just hanging out, dude. There you have it. Back to you guys. 21 followers. Yeah, yeah, man. <laughs> you know how you are. Do do do. Do you got the new moose pack and all that? They changed it this year.
it's not like last year. You know, when you buy the season pass, yeah, when you when you buy the season pass this year on this game, you get it out. <clears throat> Still, you get like the moves pack. You get this less money you have to spend, but if you buy this, you get this. <laughs> Well, true. Off. Nobody's watching me, so okay. <coughs> nah. What do you mean, spend spend your invites or messages or something? Let's get it on. Quick thinking to avoid that. Oh, this is dangerous right here. Oh, I'm, I, I can't look. He is incoming. Man, he's still down after that move. I almost wonder if his bell got seriously wrong there. Jack Swagger's outstanding amateur background as an NCAA All-American gave him an intensity that he's brought to WWE. Swagger's a former World Heavyweight Champion who will stop at nothing to be number one. Well, Cole, Jack Swagger's one of the most vicious competitors that we have in all of WWE. When he sees an opening, he takes it immediately, and then you're really in trouble. He's just playing classic offense here. Yeah, and that's when he's the most dangerous. I have a feeling we're going to see several more demonstrations like that before the night's over. Jack Swagger can launch a brutal ground attack at an opponent at any time. Swagger's ferocity turns.